Hi guys, I'm Shinbu with the one for an eye at isa ako sa mga makakasama nyo sa Play Park RF Online. So I'm making this video for a little guide and introduction plus discussion na rin on the announcement regarding the early access that will begin this November 30. Sa Thursday na mga kaibigan. So in a nutshell, pwede. Pwede kang magkaroon ng chance na malaro na ang RF Online by November 30 as Play Park will open at test server. Okay? This coming Thursday But of course You have to do something May kailangan kang gawin Para magkaroon ka ng access nga dito This is a limited early access So Huwag na natin patagalin to Simulan na natin On first things Na kailangan mong tandaan Paano makasama sa early access First up is that You have to check the Facebook page Of uh, Play Park RF Online So Doon siya unang makikita It is actually the pinned post here Where the announcement of the limited early access was made And ang simple lang uh, you, you will actually just need to go to vis- and visit yung website mismo Ng, R- ng Play Park RF Online Which is rfonline.playpark.com so, Image lang naman yan Also feel free to share na rin if ever uh, publicly Para malaman na rin ng ibang mga players At makasama rin sila sa darating na limited early access So once you click the website Mapupunta tayo dito On the updated website actually Uy, flesh is weak Oh yeah, essentially server type Para sa mga Cora As mentioned, nakalagay na dito Lahat ng kailangan yung details Siguro yung pinaka-importante talaga yan Yung pinaka-matagal yung inaabangan Is yung date mismo November 30, Thursday Hashtag stay tuned mga kaibigan So, and Andiyan lahat ng details As mentioned, this is an early access More so can be said na parang ano na rin, parang uh, close beta test. So one thing's for sure, this is a limited one. Yun yung isa sa mga bagay na kailangan tandaan. Hindi lahat ay makakalaro ng RF Online. Definitely this November 30. Hindi lahat ang may gusto. There will be a time for that once it is on full launch or even in the open beta. So ano yung mga kailangan gawin? What are the things needed para makasali ka for the early access? Okay? For the chances, first is you need to register for a Play Park uh, Play Park Play ID. Alright, napaka-simple lang. You can actually click this one. Pag pinindot mo siya, mayroong lalabas na bagong tab and you will go to this uh, website. Actually, naklik ko na siya. Ayan, where you will sign up for a Play ID either using your mobile number or you use your email address. I would recommend, I would recommend using your email address and I would even recommend using a Gmail. Hindi required. Kahit anong email, pwede mo namang gamitin. Pero siguro mas, mas okay na rin na advice ko na lang, personal advice ko na lang na ang gamitin yung email is uh, the one from Gmail. Kasi yung sunod na requirement is that you need to complete the early access application form which is a Google form. Which is mas madali talaga siya. Mas madali talaga siya ilagay dito. Pero uh, hindi naman kahit anong email pala pwede mo gamitin. Registered Play Park ID email. So kung ano yung ginamit mo kung ano yung ginamit mo ditong email yun din yung ilalagay mo dito. Of course, you include your first name, your last name, and even your mobile number. Now, importante yon yung dalawa. Email plus mobile number kasi dyan ka ikakontak ng um, dyan ka ikakontak ng Play Park. Uh, 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 if ever, pasok ka dun sa limited early access. That's, await the email or, uh, and or SMS notification that contacts your test account credentials. So, nandun din mismo. So, ayan. Ah, uh, the walang problema gumawa kayo ng maraming ano uh, play park play ID uh, yan fill up yung application form uh, I think so you could increase your chances of uh, getting that early access okay so do take note lang do take note again I cannot emphasize this hindi lahat ng applicants will receive a test account okay for the early access hindi automatic na kapag finil up nyo yung play na, nag, nagkaroon ka ng play park play ID or nagkaroon kayo ng nag finil up nyo yung early access application form hindi automatic na sure na sure na na meron kayong RF online account this will be you will be messaged randomly alright I have no idea kung ilan yung uh, kung ilang accounts yung ma-roll out pero my, my personal guess would be it should be around uh, 500 because this is a limited uh, limited early access. Also, if despite having no no uh, official announcement yet, there's a very 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 good probability that there will be a wipe on the accounts di- on this one. Uh, kasi as as mentioned doon sa website mismo, ipakita ko ulit sa inyo mga, mga ibigan. 
you can actually see here that the limited access period will employ a beta build of the RF online client. Alright? Hindi ko masabing full build, hindi ko rin masabing kulang na build. It's a beta build. Definitely, hindi yung final form. Yun yung ibig sabihin ng beta build. Hindi final form ng RF online client. And it will be a home. Oh. Imagine that. A home to bugs and errors that we are all hungry to sniff and identify. So, para sa akin, ito actually yung pinaka-importanting parte kapag nakakuha ka ng early access. Ito mga kaibigan, tandaan nyo to, rfteam at playpark.net. This is an email, not a website. Pag clinic mo yan, walang lalabas, blanco. This is an email that you need to contact using your own email if ever may nakita kayong bugs. Paano kami magre-report ng bugs? Simply take a screenshot, take a video, even kahit i-report nyo siya in text form. Pero it's better to collate it here. Hindi sa Facebook. Okay, hindi sa Facebook at hindi rin sa Facebook group nyo ipopost yung mga bugs na yon. Dito, dito kayo mag email mga chong. So, just a uh, quick pointers na nasabi rin doon sa mismong website. Early access core features is that boosted. Yan, no? Mga <laughs> ibigan, boosted ang XP, ang PT, ang item drop, and mining rates. So, it kind of can be said na mas... Um, mas mataas yung rates nito compared to the normal and intended rates ng uh, ating server pero there is also uh, a correlation or a guess na ibig sabihin nito mas ma hindi ganun kahaba hindi ganun kahaba itong early access natin kasi boosted experience siya PT item drop and mining rates so as much as possible syempre gusto natin mag level up gustong, gusto natin malaman hindi lang yung problem sa start pa lang o sa tutorial pa lang kundi sa lahat on all facets of the game kung possible nga baka may makapag max level pa nga diba dito sa limited early access and so just a little reminder for discussion sake again sa lahat siguro ng makakuha ng ano, sa lahat siguro na makakuha ng early access, do take note na aside from playing mga kaibigan and maybe some sort of bragging rights alam naman natin, ang tagal natin naglalaro ng RF and sabi daw nila, eh merong uh, ibang klaseng achievement kapag nakapaglaro ka ng beta as naglaro ka pa sa o, eh, naglaro ka sa CBT, naglaro ka sa OBT lahat na ng T mga kaibigan eh, legendary ka na paborito paborito natin yung term na yon legendary ladies and gentlemen sige okay na yon pero sa natanda lang natin that we have a responsibility if we got an early access account and that is actually to spot out the problems mismo sa game now <laughs> ginagawa naman para mapaganda lalo yung game pero this time ang ganda dito ay mas involved na tayo ngayon tayong mga players here with this uh, limited early access ngayon naman siguro for the discussion of bakit hindi pwedeng bakit hindi pwedeng lahat uh, bakit hindi pwedeng dagdagan na lang yung early access there are reasons for that definitely uh, I have no idea this is not actually you know speaking in, in in behalf of play park pero my best guess here is to take note that higher population sa certain game would require higher server capacity mas mataas na server capacity and server capacity increases cost so there is that Again, again, kati lang naman yung mga yung mga dakila yung may mga may dakilang layunin para mapaganda yung server and I hope it would instill onto you kapag nakuha nyo na yung early access and again, hindi nga kayo sa group dapat nag hindi kayo sa group magpo-post hindi sa Facebook merong email yan rfteam at playpark.net so, ayan ayan mga kaibigan very likely one thing's for sure for the most part meron na tayong mga kasama na maglalarot makakarating sa ating bagong RF online server at uh, here in the Philippines as yung official server natin dito sa Philippines also it is declared by Playpark ang bagong pangalan ng ating server nandito siya sa page naku nalilipat mga chong um, pakita ko lang sa inyo and the server name the winning server name as voted would be Novus okay Novus ang pangalan actually ng sector doon sa sa lore at sa story ng RF Online. So, and I guess, I guess ladies and gentlemen, we'll be battling it off sa Novus Sector. So, there you have it. That's gonna be my time, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, bago pala ako matapos, gusto ko imbitahan sa darating na Play Park XP event 2017. Pakita ko ulit yung desktop ko. So, this is... Lagi na lang to. So, this is the... Makikita nyo to sa uh, page mismo ng Play Park. Ayan. This is going to happen on SM North Edsa. Sky Dome, December 10 Sa Sunday, napakalapit na rin In less than 2 weeks actually, if I'm not mistaken 
Uh, well, yeah, 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 yeah. Less than two weeks nga. So, you know, starting at 10am until 8pm. Ang daming naka-feature na pwedeng gawin dito. You can even do the volunteer program if you check the events page. Pwede kayong masali and ma-involve in organizing this. We also have the Christmas caroling, Christmas cosplay, exchange gift, and I'll be hosting that event kasama si Ville. So... And mga kaibigan, once again, I am Shinbu with a one for an I and Kita Kits in the battle for Novas.